You know, it was obviously a lot of damage done here, uh, not just to the district, but to the county in general. But you know, our buildings held up pretty well. Obviously, um, some damage, nobody escaped it uh, completely clean. Um, but we've done most of the roofs that needed repair. Um, obviously, taking care of mold remediation uh, from any leaks or anything like that. The last big roofing project that we've got left is Burgall Elementary School, which is uh, to begin shortly. The, the crews are over there. They're just uh, waiting to get started. Um, that'll be the last big one that we've got. Also, Topsail Elementary School's uh, gymnasium is going to get uh, recoding, I believe, to uh, help seal up some issues there. Um, but yeah, those are the last two big ones uh, that we've got. Everything else is, is pretty good, pretty, pretty square, and uh, we're, we're back on track. I think you mentioned new generator put in. That's just kind of precautions for the future. Yeah, uh, the, the generator that we had uh, was uh, World War II era, so it had uh, been around for a long time, and uh, they didn't make parts for it anymore. So uh, we decided in order to keep uh, the servers and central office here, uh, you know, functional in case of another storm that we would look into uh, getting a new generator. We actually got a grant uh, through through the state um, to, to take care of that. So the new generator has been installed and uh, will be uh, will be state of the art and uh, make sure that our power needs are met if the power is to ever uh, go out here because of the storm. If needed in the future, does Pender County still plan on using schools for shelters? Uh, absolutely. We'll definitely still uh, be a shelter facility uh, throughout the county at uh, numerous different schools. In fact, this year we actually uh, got more of our principals, our assistant principal, school staff involved in uh, Red Cross training uh, so that they can be kind of uh, administrators and facilitators when their school is used uh, as a shelter uh, in, in the need of a storm. Um, so yeah, we're, we're definitely uh, making sure that the community knows that we're a place that they can go and, uh, and ride out the storm.